you know, they were they had turned the team over to McHale. Nice offhand layup there by Mather. Ooh, they got that little stump. It's a little bit too easy. Yeah, you, you almost like default to him. But you will default to him. That's why I'm saying it's too easy. Mather. Now he's learning. Now he is learning. Landale to figure out is that in fact he's going to hit him and either takes the charge or just backs out of the way because that'll throw him off balance. Matherin gets it back from Tice. Nice and tempo. And he's going to attack again, try to draw the foul. But he's setting that screen with one purpose. Oh, yeah, absolutely. The nature, and you know, JJ and, and Chris, the nature of it is the guy that sets the screen is more than likely the guy that's going to be open. But he's setting that screen with one purpose. Oh, yeah, absolutely. The nature, and you know, JJ and, and Chris, the nature of it is the guy that sets the screen is more than likely the guy that's going to be open. But he's setting that screen with one purpose. Oh, yeah, absolutely. The nature, and you know, JJ and, and Chris, the nature of it is the guy that sets the screen is more than likely the guy that's going to be open. But he's setting that screen with one purpose. Oh, yeah, absolutely. The nature, and you know, JJ and, and Chris, the nature of it is the guy that sets the screen is more than likely the guy that's going to be open. Working at it. Because one of the things that's challenged the Pacers is the points off of turnovers. Because they, they really haven't gotten any points off of the turnovers. But Phoenix, oh, Matherin is ready to go. Nice job. Very good de defensive job. Fumbling it. Picked up. That's why it was a good job. And what a dunk. And looking at a 10 point second quarter. Right. So a 10 point quarter for Benedict Matherin. Tracks it down just before he goes into the backcourt. Take the pick. There you go. And he wanted a foul. No foul coming. They haven't got the quality of shots. You've got it for a while, remember. You were able to get some things going because you got Halliburton back. Out of bounds. But now Turner in the corner. Matherin just came in. His three off, batted out by Neesmith. Kuzma and the Washington Wizards. They beat Washington very early in the year. There's that rip through again by Paul. And the Suns, that, that's what they do. They take you out of your rhythm. Pacers shooting just 38% from the field. Paul trying for two more. Rebound tipped out by Craig, but the Pacers have it with Matherin. Rebound tipped out by Craig, but the Pacers have it with Matherin. He's going to attack. Goes right to the basket and got it. The three guys waiting on him made it happen. If it's not a direct line pass, guys can get it. If you get a little air on it, you're under five on the shot clock. Shot clock at four, lost his balance. Thank you. Booker and Chris Paul missed some time, but yeah, yeah Booker's yeah. the big one. Both of them. Terrific pass, but a miss. It was, cutting again. Matherin from McConnell. A lot of teams from is the ability to sustain their success. Good job by Jackson into the hands of Matherin. And he goes right at it, but Duarte follows and scores against Miami on Wednesday night. Matherin. Nice delivery. Really nice delivery in that transition. That, that's something he didn't have last year. 13th double figure game of the year for Isaiah Jackson. He's got 12 points. He's hit all four of his field goal tries. And he threw it away. Taken by Matherin. So that lead goes to 17. Matherin drives on Booker, goes inside, and counted. I mean, I'm, I'm looking at the staff asking the same question about him. Six of six at the line tonight. 32 minutes for Matherin, seven of 15 from the field. Good to see. Hadn't, hadn't quite been up 